Uh, good evening. I'm Mark Taylor, 12912 Sycamore Circle. I'm speaking tonight to request that you delay the vote on the second reading of the proposed five-year strategic plan that's to take place on Wednesday. There are several reasons this should be delayed. First, starting next month, there will be a large changeover in the members of the BOE. Over the next few months, the board will change greatly. At least four and possibly as many as five new members will take their seats at the board. Those new members will be subject to a plan that they had no say in or no opportunity to vote for. To rush this plan without giving those incoming members an opportunity to voice their opinions and to be a part of the approval process is unfair to them and unfair to the citizens who voted for them. Secondly, the latest version of this plan was only released late last week. The public deserves the opportunity to thoroughly dissect and review this latest revision before it is voted on. Less than one week is not ample time. Thirdly, no legitimate effort has been made by the board to assimilate an alternative plan that has been put together by the students, parents, and educators of Knox County. Several of you have stated agreement with much of Speak's plan. My question is this. Are you going to assimilate that material into your plan? If you agree with it and see value in it, then shouldn't that be done? Knox County Schools preaches the need for community input from all levels. You have now been given that input. If you rush to pass this immediately, you are coming across as if you really don't care what the input the community gives you. If this is not correct, then reach out to those who have worked tirelessly to do what is best for the children of Knox County. As a board, I ask you to sit down with those who have put so much effort into these suggestions and compare the two plans point by point, have a rigorous conversation about the two plans, and work together to come up with the best plan possible for the students of Knox County. Finally, there's just no reason this has to be voted on this week. I'm sure we will hear the argument that we set a timeline, so we're going to do what we said and vote now. That is not acceptable. It's a five-year plan. One or two more months spent to get it right is what Knox County deserves. Do not fall into that trap we all witnessed during the superintendent's recent contract extension. Do not rush Knox County into this when we do not have to be rushed. Do what is best for our students' long-term direction and actively engage input to make this plan the best it can be. Thank you. Thank you. Sheila Arrow.